Yes! <laughs> Let's go guys. How are you doing? I'm Daily Fix. We are continuing with EU4 playing as uh, as England. Oh now Great Britain. Um doing the the how is the achievement called again? I've been typing it in my uh, in my titles for such a time now. Let's take a look. It is the Anglo Peel achievement. <laughs> We're not nearly there. Ah damn, there's so much we need to do. So uh, we've been focusing pretty much on expansion, which, you know, it could be good, could be bad, not particularly sure yet. Um, let's see, we've got some money, manpower is going up. So, there is one thing that I want to do. So, right now, I... Could I handle this? Hmm... It is, especially like the colonies, that is a bit of the problem. I kind of want to handle this, especially like Sweden. Which is going to be somewhat problematic, uh, since we're already fighting it. So, if I want to do this, then I need to make sure that we got an army in here. Right now, the Swedish have 36,000 troops. So, it would be fair if I get about 50k up there. Um, taking a look at their allies, there's some over here, but this is the, the main uh, thing of it. What we want to do is break the alliance with Russia if we peace out the Swedish. That's what we want to do. Uh, we want to get this, uh, Gibraltar, that is, so we can get claims on Aragon for the islands. So then we can go to war with Aragon. And we want to get as much of his coastal regions as possible. But the main focus for us with Castile is getting these colonies under our belt. Um, there is a lot of units coming from the colonies. And it would be nice if we can take them away. Uh, also, in the future, a war with Portugal taking the Portuguese Alaska. And uh, it would be quite okay. I don't know why it's not up for grabs at the moment. Because I think... Is it being sieged down? Because it... No, it's at war. Buta. I think it's... Where the hell is that? Take a look here. Who are you fighting? So you're fighting in here. Yeah, definitely a war with Castile would be... Very, very nice. Uh, Portugal, sorry. Uh, so we can actually get all of this. Definitely, I want Africa down here. Um, it's not part of a trade league, I think. No, actually it is. All of it is. So, if we can take that, then that would actually be quite, quite nice. So, we're still in this war. Our mercenaries are doing its thing. Our ally is just continuing... We don't necessarily have to pay attention to the Dutch Wars because I think that we can actually handle those. Um, there is the Brandenburg War of Succession is now done. I don't know if we actually got something out of this. I don't think so. I don't think so. The Spirit of Succession with Saxony, but that he will solve for himself. Um, Bomithia, 44. Uh... Let's see. Okay, so it is France and Austria. I really don't want to be in that war. I think we have plenty other things to do. Uh, right now, he is... What is the supply limit over there? I want you to go over there. Since we will be fighting Castile, we might as well have our troops in there. Fighting that main army. Might be a bit risky, though. Might be a bit risky. But... I guess we'll find out how that will go. Um, as for you, I need you to stop drilling. And I want you to go over there with the fleets. Uh, what fleet are we using? The one that's over there. 51 transport ships. So why the hell not? Uh, we got these 27,000 troops just uh, going over here. I do want to get started in this war because we actually do need some territory. Uh, we're just building colonies here now, just, just to be occupied. Oh, man. This is also Castile, isn't it? No, it is not. Are you kidding me? No, no, it's a colony under Castile. Interesting. 
transfer straight to Castile. Has a choice with Gumba, supporting independence. Well, that's not going to happen. But I would really like to take all of that as well. Damn, there's so much I want to take. Also, this guy is getting really short. Really small, actually. He's still allied. Vassalization. Distance between borders. Hmm. If we get closer, we can actually vassalize him and just force feed the entire India to him. I think that would be... Not too bad. Okay, we're making a lot of money again. Who is this guy? Are we still building up against you? Um, I don't think I want to stop doing that. Uh, do we actually wait? Cancel that. Can we get claims? I don't think so. Because this guy, uh, Jolof, who are we of course not fighting, will have to fight afterwards. We do have a claim upon you. If I... Actually, he is at war. Really, no. Yeah, of course, it's the main main war goal, you dumb dumb. We do have to take this. Of course, there are new rebels. Now, there's also one thing that I... I was watching Andrail, also a EU4 streamer and YouTuber, and he showed us something that was actually quite interesting in getting autonomy. And I really felt that that's something that was worth a shot to actually try. So if you are having like these lower at of increased autonomy guys, the British uh, fellas over here who actually have 71. Look at that. It's insane. If we handle them, we accept demands that will increase the influence of the burger. So I would actually like to hold on until we can actually get rid of some of these things. So... It doesn't really tell me when I can actually get rid of that. Hmm. 37. Damn, I hope not. That would be way too long. Okay, I'll, I'll wait until it is somewhere in the region of 50. If it's still not there, we'll accept the autonomy increase. And we'll save up a lot of admin. It's that we're just going to be force-feeding this into our vessel over here, Mali. That I will just allow it. Let's take this back. Uh, we're now in one war. Let's get to our other troops. Who, by the looks of it, are still on the move. So, once they're all there, we start drilling again. We will. And slowly we're focusing more on the missions. There you go. Let's just start drilling. And you... Actually, that is you. You are now over there as well. Start drilling. Uh, of course, your mercenaries cannot drill. That is a shame, but it is what it is. We also want to start investing more in our trade companies, which are, well, somewhat... Uh, I kind of neglected them, and it, it's bad. It is bad. Also, 73. What, why is that? Uh, because we lost a crap ton of ships over here. The flagship is gone. Ah, oh, damn you, dumbass. I've lost so many ships. Okay, let's get started on the flagship again. Uh, actually, that's the wrong button. Uh, build flagship here in Norfolk. Um, no. <laughs> Centurion. Yeah, sure, why not? I still want it to be heavy. Trade per fleet. Um, movement speed. On and off ships. I think that's nice. Oh, no, actually, no, it's the other one. Ship movement speed. Fleet movement speed. And fleet morale. Is there anything better than a fleet morale? Could get at more cannons, fleet engagement. Uh, fleet blockade impact on siege. Well, this is just a light fleet. Eventually, I will add a few heavies just to keep them safe. Heavies are absolutely great, but they lower the speed of these fleets quite, quite a bit. So, we got a bunch of cash, and I'm very sure we can actually... Oh, yeah, we can actually add a lot of ships. Okay, before we do this, we have 18 heavies over here. And... Mm, let's start adding them to 25. Slowly, we'll just increase that number over time. We've got enough transports for now. Let us get this fella and... Just go mental on the lights over here. There we go. All of those can be built. Uh, your imports over there. Um, he has a fleet in here. And it's it's just transports. Which is, you know, not a big deal. Actually, the 
the best option here would be uh, that's 37 39 39 oh come on there has to be something i can land my trips in without taking attrition order it is it is not possible eventually we just have to accept more cultures as well um that's over here though we can add one more I'm not sure if i should add these though i want the danish in here that's weird oh actually there is the danish uh and the norwegians so that's one percent that is not enough to do actually actually take that on don't need that he is collecting still he will collect a lot more uh we'll have to get this fleet in with our trade fleet the second this stops we're not mothballing it anymore and we're still making crap ton of money which is absolutely absolutely great let's take a look over here make sure you transfer all of that place uh marley is not liking us which is his own problem i don't care about that okay let's go back over here marley um do we already have a claim over there Uh, is there a particular reason why I can't take this? Okay. Quite simple. Because we're at war. So this entire building up spy network is not going to help me at all. Also. We do need to build up on Castile. There was another thing. I already am starting to forget. Which is problematic. Should not do that. Let's think. Hmm. Oh yeah, Marley, of course. I need to improve relations with him. Um, let's make sure we do this. Uh, dynasty actions. I don't think I can do that, actually. No, the faith does not allow us to do this. So right now, what we're going to be doing is... Relations. Improve. Ah, oh, damn. I always misclick that. Improve this relations. There we go. So can I actually force religion upon him? No. That's a bloody shame. Let's go on siege. Everyone on siege there. Uh, we'll just continue over here. Let's press set and give that to Marley as well. He's going to explode. He doesn't know it yet. Let's go take our forces over there. Do we have the force march yet? Can? Yeah, they do. Awesome. Awesome. Love that. It will take me a military point. Definitely worth it for him here. I want to finish this war up really soon. And fighting these guys is going to be quite important. Let's make sure that we try to catch them. He's moving over there. Is there going to be a fight? No, there is. Will they... No, of course not. They won't reinforce that because they just don't have the time for it. You're going over there. Let's... Oh yeah, that's going to be lovely. That's going to be a nice war. There we go. And we'll send you... There we go. Send you over there. Let's take that siege. They're all drilling now. That's great. A peace offer from Jolo. No, thank you. I'll be my own judge about that. Don't need it. I'll go a bit slower. So, let us take a look. How many troops do we still have? And how many can we still make? About 10. One is still going to be made. Do we have enough cannons over here? 20, 20. Yeah, of course you don't have any. Uh, you can still be built into a good size army. Force limit of 41 over here. So if we can just add 10 over here. And we can actually go up to a force limit of 40 in this region. So we'll save up a tiny bit more. Let's go back to this fight. Um... He should actually have to deal with those. It's annoying that I have to go back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. But that's the problem with, uh, I think, rebels. Or actually with mercenaries. We can't split them anymore. It used to be so good. It used to be so incredibly, incredibly good. But I understand they changed it, though. Local goods, pursuits, modify. Of course, of course they do. Should we start building this army up? Let's see. Two more calf. Okay, so we'll just wait until those are constructed. So one, 
And two, so that would that would be three. Yeah, that's really difficult counting, right? <laughs> Let's get those out. Love being natives. Let's get a cannon in there. We get a cannon in there. How many cannons are we now building? Why don't you show what you're building, mate? Weird. Oh well. We'll just give it a oh, the infantry is is really it doesn't take too long. Land maintenance modifier will be increased, but the drill modifier will be increased. Let's take a look here. Supply depots. And we're slowly increasing all of that. I really like that we finally hit salaried soldiers. And there's a revolt here from some separatists, which we are, of course are not going to deal with. Let's take a look if actually Mexico. That's Colombia. Mexico. You cannot. British Mexico is at war. Okay, of course you are. It's a shame that we've called every one of those in. Sometimes it's just easier if they were not in there. British Louisiana is like a boss. Look at that. It's expanding like crazy. Uh, the 13 colonies are about to get all of that as well. It's quite a shame that Holland actually has this region. So in the next war with Holland, we'll take as much away from him as possible. Uh, Flanders is here, who is actually, I believe, my ally. Are you my ally? Let's see. Yeah, you are. We could improve, but, eh, you know, it's not really needed. Shall we take the modifier here? Actually, we, I, I kind of want to do this. The drill army would be quite nice. And I don't, don't want to lose this. So let's take that off. Uh, we're still building up influence ideas. Are we focusing on it? Uh, we're, uh, we're, we are focusing on it. But he's level 1. We cannot upgrade him. Is anyone better? Ah, not really, no. Not really, no. So, come on. Can we actually... Yeah, we'll transfer all these uh, provinces later. It, it, it's just doing that all the time. is just tedious. Let us start building up against Castile. Look, a tutor is going to be in here. And he is also a tutor. Is there no way that I can, you know, bring this to my advantage? Hey, Wenek, how are you doing, buddy? Proclaim guarantee? Ah, I don't think so. Claim throne? You can only claim a throne if you have a royal marriage. Can we? They must not have a legitimate heir. Ah, oh, damn it. Or a weak claim. Oh, so that's how it works. Oh, that feels so stupid. Uh, loyalties, but army tradition. I kind of don't want to... Drop my army traditions. They did royal marriage me. I, I don't... I don't uh, damn, that means I have a truce with them, don't I? Let's wait until he's back. Until the 19. I can't claim this throne, which is bloody, bloody unfortunate. He is 18. Bomifia. Uh, if I can royal marriage him, it would be great. But I have to... You know, maybe just France. Go against France again. If this war is not going to be good for us. Let's see, how is this one doing actually? You guys are still seizing that down. Damn. Takes forever, dude. Takes bloody forever. So the 19th over there. Let's go back to Castile. Let's take a look here. Is there anything I can do? If I declare war upon you now, we have a royal marriage. Damn. Okay, so maybe that was not the... Let's see, colonial war. Okay, I guess we'll go against friends then. Meaning these guys can just go... I can't drill in in, in, in other regions. I'm going to ignore you, Wenek. Um, let's see. If we declare war here, it's a lot less. Savoy is not willing to come in because we have already so many multiple wars. We want this war to finish. So let's continue over here. Maybe we should turn this off. Too many diplomatic relations. Ah, of course, yeah, the, the royal marriage. 
But it wouldn't it be great if we still got it? Wouldn't that be great? France is a really, really young, young heir, a young king. So not yet an heir yet. Okay, so we're building up over here. Okay, how many... I don't understand. Why do... Let's take a look here. We're currently making... Six ships over there, three over there. That makes no sense. Is this the only two reason, uh, regions where I can actually build that up? Oh, yeah. I think I know what happens. Okay, we got a 322, which is absolutely horrible. Let's call him Alfred. Hmm. Strong claim, though. He's 40. Uh, okay, I guess it is what it is. Okay, let's just add 19 and 4. At least that's going to be enough. Let's build that up. Um, 19, 4, and 15. I think this is going over 30, isn't it? Wait a minute. I need to learn how to count. 15 and 15 would be 30. So this is definitely going over... Hmm. Let's get rid of those. There are regiments that are going to be constructed in here. Okay, we'll cancel those. Because I apparently did not learn how to count. Actually, we're going to 40, didn't I? Yeah, I'm a dumb dumb. It's fine. Let's go over here. This siege is still going on. That's just awful. That is just awful. And I would like to get these guys at least back. So many bloody rebels. Okay, he's finally happy. Uh, once these forts fall, that is the, the best area. Actually, we should go back. Kill these rebels. There we go. Move on them. I will kill the rebels. And hopefully my ally could be more interested in defending this region. Instead of going on a fort, which he cannot take forever. Maybe we, we should piece this out. We'll just get all of this back and we'll piece it out. Oh no, so you do not disappear on me. I will not have it. Yeah, that's really low morale. Look at that. That was when we were fighting France. It was the same. Uh, France was just absolutely a beast. Actually, we'll take this back and then we go there. I don't care that he's fighting rebels. Let's take a look. So, we can actually piece him out. Two for peace. And this should... Can I not give this? Actually, yeah, it is going to Mali. It's still costing me, though. Bloody shame. Ah, uh, we'll just take two. Get some cash out of you, if possible. There's a tiny bit going on with the coalition over there. Yeah, but I don't think they dare to attack. We'll take these. And now peace out the other fella in 24 days. Also... Let's go to Mali. Enforce religion. He's not going to like it, but I'm going to do it. Yeah, he's not going to be happy about it, but who cares. Uh, knowledge sharing. Hmm... Grand the province. We cannot grant the province yet. We need this one to connect all of it. But right now we're at war. So let's just get out of here. Let's just immediately drop on those rebels. Just stay part of my country, dude. And I will make you great again. Let's see, 78, which will be fine. Seriously, I need to go back to my own bloody regions. <laughs> That's a bloody shame. Okay, let's speed up here for a second. I'm not going to call this because I'm going to give it away. I'm not going to mess with the religion. I'm going to let Molly do it. Well, we improve with Molly, which is good. We should build up with friends. Okay, you're back now. Let's take this.
If I could split my armies, then that would have been great. Let's go take these down. Let's press Z here. Let's give it to Marley. Let's just make sure that in this peace deal, this becomes part of it. So you, 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 and you. Actually, we can already do this peace deal. All of it will be given to Marley. We'll do that right now. So let's go over here, Marley. A Grand Province. And actually, this should be making him very happy. There we go, 66. So it's going to be a short while. Well, we could actually give this away. It's not very interesting to have, actually. And there we go. You can have all of that. We'll fight those rebels for you, mate. You can actually turn the Force Mars off because, well, we're not needing it anymore. Um, that are his rebels. I don't care about. All of this continues. Let's get our mercs back in there. Uh, something funny is going on. Occupied by Opal. Who are you fighting, dude? How bad is it? Oh, that's gorgeous. That is gorgeous. So, these ships are going to be picking them up. They are doing good. Meaning, these trips over here, they make no bloody sense. So, we'll wait until the mercs get back. We'll send these trips over there. Let's stop uh, drilling with you. We are going to be keeping improvement up with Marley. He's at 61. He's not going to break away because I'm going to tear him a new one. I'll be messing him up, that's for sure. Let's take a look. Now, you are not going to be a March Gastony because we're actually going to integrate you eventually. But not right now. Okay, so are my mercs being transported right now? Okay, they all stopped drilling, which is good. Got some heavies in here, which we should actually just move. So let's take a look here. Ah, uh, those are some light ships. Okay, what we'll do right now is we'll get all of our heavies. Uh, we're still making a few of them. How far are we? How far are we with that? So, 30%. Uh, almost close. We're, we're, we're getting very close. We need to wait until these, uh, these ships get back anyways. So, once we got all of the heavies, we're going to be adding them to the same fleet. So, one more to go. And there's a revolt over here. Yeah, he should be able to deal with that. Not going to deal with it for him. Uh, let's take a look who has depths. Actually... Enforce religion. I'll have to check on that. I'm I'm really slow with these things, so give me give me a tiny bit of a break. Let's see, six percent. Do you have a depth issues? No, you're not. So he's actually decreasing now, which is good. Um. Religion. Holy shit, look at that. Okay, Mexico is having issues. I think his... Um, what do you say? Like the subsidies have ended? Austria? Yeah, I'm not going to pay for you having to... You know, you're not colonizing anything. Start a colonial war. That's not. I'll do that myself. How about you? Okay, no debt. We can't do that. Okay, we'll wait until we can pay off the uh, the Mexican loan because that is insane. And he's still losing money. Okay, so he's probably going way too fast with this. Lose prestige or legitimacy. Uh, let's lose the legitimacy. Uh, we'll get yearly absolutism or admin, efi admin efficiency would be quite nice. Autonomy cooldown is also very good. Change rivals, negative 50. Oh, damn, look at that. Let's go with the admin efficiency. I think that's the best one. Um, once we get the army up to 200, we'll actually start the golden age. I don't know why I should wait with that. 
We're at nine. I, like I said, there is a, a way. Uh, we're actually not at war right now. 